Mr. Bidoku, Dixon Bidoku. Uh, I teach chemistry, physics, and principles of engineering here at Booker T. Washington Senior High School. Um, I have over nine years teaching experience. O over the years, um, I've always been pushing that um, my students, you know, participate in, uh, in internship programs, uh, particularly during summer. Um, it provides them the opportunity to go out, you know, in the field and learn first-hand, hands-on experience of most of the concepts they, they learn in class. We are the parents to two amazing ch children. One was Danica Vance and the other one was named J.J. Vance. J.J. died when he was 14 years old from a disorder that we now call thrombotic storm. And this was when we were living in North Carolina and we were both at Duke University. So in honor of him, we set up an internship. What we want is uh, to inspire individuals to get involved in science. And the concept of the internship is to help students experience research, to get them excited about the, the concepts of research and science, and to realize that they could do this. Also to understand the processes of how that they could get involved in science. They make personal contacts with professionals in the lab and other students as well. They can interact with undergraduates, uh, graduate students, postdoctoral fellows, as well as physicians. Each student is paired with their own personal mentor or a group of mentors from, from primary investigators laboratory. We started uh, very small with only two high schools. When we uh, moved to Miami, we wanted to continue this uh, same opportunity. Such opportunities actually help, you know, in the long run. The, it it kind of like helps the students to say, you know what, I think this is what I want to do. We have gradually expanded the program here. We have now over uh, a close to 50 high schools. Here in Miami, uh, this is a real unique opportunity um, to get in uh, kids who don't have a lot of exposure to science involved in uh, the creativity that goes along with uh, scientific research. The students have all uh, done well in getting into uh, schools. Many of them have uh, changed their interest and now focus on science, and the e over 80% of the kids are now in us uh, uh, taking majors that are science-related. We have an application process where we really let the students put input into it. It's not just based, based on grades, and I want to stress that. It's on somebody's desire to want to learn more about science and to have this experience. And we like to emphasize students who otherwise don't have other opportunities to experience something like the J.J. Vance internship. It's very important, particularly for students uh, from schools like us here at um, uh, Booker T. Washington Senior High School, which is an inner city school. Um, these, kids, these students are from socially uh, and economically disadvantaged um, area. So the internship provides them that opportunity to experience what a workplace looks like. You know, uh, this is an opportunity that normally um, they would not get. We pay our interns each uh, stipend because we realize that there are uh, kids who have financial situations such that they have to have a make some money in the in the summer and need a summer job but we didn't want that to be a uh, something that blocked their participation they bring that experience back to the class um, you know and they also discuss that with their fellow students and that kind of like motivate others to want to you know look out for such internship opportunities so it's it's um it's a real great thing for you know, for our students here. It was probably one of the best experiences I've had just because it wasn't a show internship. They didn't do the work for you. You actually did the work yourself. So that benefited me a lot because I learned more. I felt like I really did contribute to whatever cause I was working with. I learned new things that I didn't pick up in the classroom. I met new friends. 
bond I bonded with other students from different schools, different backgrounds. Uh, it's once in a lifetime experience. Uh, you get to work with uh, professionals and get to see firsthand uh, what goes on in the lab and also get to work with mentors who actually care and uh, want to see you succeed. You had people who supported you and like taught you you know how to pretty much to do things correctly and I think um, that sort of support is really helpful to kids. It's just completely different when you're actually in a real lab and it's not something that you go and you are bored and you're reading a book and they're like, oh, do this and do that. It's devoted to you really learning. You're with somebody and they're guiding you the entire way and it's, it's, it's new, it's, it's refreshing and it's beautiful and I love the experience entirely. Anybody who really wants to learn about research, who really wants to go into science, or anybody who just wants to have a fulfilling experience should definitely get involved with that DJJ Vance internship. It's really personally rewarding because we can't think of a better way to, uh, you know, to remember our son. Because if anybody who knew JJ, JJ was such an outgoing, amazing young man who always thought of everybody else first and gave to everybody else. So something like this where we're giving back to the community, to other students, would just make him would, would just make him really happy. And I think that's what I think is really important and really makes us happy. The effects we can have on on other other in, kids in their lives. It's really it's really yeah. important to yeah. us. I, I, I agree that's one of the great um, things we can do here is for us personally is just to continue the memory of our son JJ, and and, uh, and you know when you lose a son, he's he's with you every day in what you do and the decisions you make, and um, so we're very proud of of him and who he was, and we're proud of of what we've been able to to push forth in his name. It's an awesome program.